Hello everyone, I'm Sofa. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'll be sharing with you on Jamboard. So first of all, let me bring you through how to get this Jamboard. It's free for all the Google account users. So how you do it is you go to your Gmail and you can go to this, scroll down to your Google Apps there and find Jamboard. Of course, another way is that you just simply click type jamboard.google.com at your search bar, all right? So here, I do not have a Jamboard yet. How do I want to create one? It's simple. Just tap plus to create one here, all right? At the bottom right. You can also create a Jamboard in a Google Meet meeting itself. It's called the whiteboard. So here you can rename your Jamboard. So I'll just put a test over here. And if you can see on top, there is this one, means this is a page one. So it's quite simple. You here, you can see undo, redo function, zoom function, set background. You can always change to other background if you want some grid line. And yeah, clear frame means totally clear everything if you write anything here later. And how you want to do this, you can always share with other participants. Share that to the link. Now it's private only to me. So here, you can change the access here by putting it, like anyone with the link can either view it or you want them to edit it. Okay, you can copy and paste the link to share it to other people. So let me share with you what are the functions. Pen, okay, pen means like, okay, you can just directly draw. And of course, here you can choose whether how fine or how thick you want it to be. All right, see, I can do it like that. And you can change the color. These are the few colors that's available. Okay, here is the eraser. And yeah, I think the eraser size is the same one, one eraser size. If you don't want, you can just click clear frame. That's it. Here is the select, uh, select any item, but I think now because there is no item, hold on. So sticky note, once I click it, you have different color, but of course there are not too many fancy colors. It's just a few basic ones. And you can directly type hi there. So far. All right, then click save. Ta-da, here you appear one. Then I want to create another one. Let's do it. Hi there, hi Shirley. All right, see, so here you can move it and you can expand it. And what you can do is the three dots, you can edit it, duplicate it, delete it or order it. All right, order it because uh, stand backward or stand forward like that. Okay, see how you want to arrange it. And next one, you can also add images by uploading it through from your computer, camera, Google Images, Google Drive, or even your Google Photos. Um, circle, okay, here is to add a shape, for example, here, right, nice, yeah, I think it's quite interesting, here, perhaps you want to draw something in a meeting, okay, or you want to do a mind map, perhaps you can use this as well, text is just uh, text, okay, without any borders and so on, welcome, so that is how you do it. And here, this is a laser pointer. It means, uh, example, you, you are brainstorming for ideas with your team and you want to go through the discussion. So in the discussion, you can use laser pointer to lead or where you are referring to. And you can always use this mouse to move your sticky note. Yeah, we can't meet physically right now because of the pandemic, but I think this kind of tools can enable us to brainstorm in a more interesting way. Yeah, and the good thing is it's all saved in the Google Drive and you can always edit the sharing access to the people. So here, let me see what is this. Oh, you can feel color to the shapes. Let's try. Yeah, that's interesting. And this, I believe, is the line outlined. Yeah. Okay, so these are the few basic functions in brainstorming. And if you want to add another frame, you can do it. Just click next and it will 
go to the next one. All right. Yeah. So maybe this one, first round discussion, second round discussion, and so on. So it's as simple as that. So hope you like this sharing and feel free to subscribe or even comment below if you would like to explore more Google app products. Thank you very much. See you.